Hey guys, this is Sasuke, and welcome back to the Darkest Dungeon. So, yesterday we got some more level fives. Today, we're gonna go take on the Swine God. Yeah. I pretty much decide I want to do a bleed team with a heavy debuffer and Richard, and Richard is literally gonna sit in the back and spam the weakening curse on the big guy the entire time. That's all that's gonna happen. Nothing else. Um, and if you think I'm kidding, you're sorely mistaken. It, why is why why is that not going over there? Why did, do I have to drag now? Did they really change that? There's no way they changed that. Am I crazy, or did I? I guess I always had to drag. Maybe, I, maybe I'm just losing it, guys. I just I've lost all control. I'm, I've officially gone crazy. Where's that one thing? My 7% damage, minus 4 dodge for 15% protection. That's an interesting idea. That would be crazy. Look, that gives him 10 HP. I think we're gonna see what this does. 15% damage, so we gain some damage. I like this. So we gain 5% damage, we lose 4 dodge, but in the process we gain a butt ton of protection and a lot of bleed chance. I like that. Might be pretty good. Okay, you. What do you get? Probably the scouting map. No, we can get the scouting map to you. We got the scouting map, and of course your cauldron. You'll get this, and I guess just this. Damage combo. It's not bad on him. Or we could just do this. A little less damage for less stat drop. I think I like that idea. A little bit better, because he's going to be a damage dealer as well. Mainly in bleeds, but I mean, that's still a damage. So... Yeah. I, I'm a little concerned with this party, but I think it's going to work fine. Let's go ahead and switch back his skill, since he's going to be dedicated to the third slot. And uh, let's carry on our way. Now, if you guys remember, the Swine God is what slayed, slew, slaughtered um, some of our allies last time. So it's kind of going to be a redemption run, if anything. I'm always bringing the high, high, high amount way too much than you actually need. But I always bring it to be sure, so I'm going to bring eight and a half torches. Mm, maybe two medicinals, just in case. I always overstock on these boss The great fights, thing I had managed meh. to bring through was brutish and stupid. Moreover, it required prodigious amounts of meat to sustain itself. But this was only a trifling concern. After all, I had a village full of it. <laughs> yes, sacrifice everybody you know and love to the great swine god. Now, I'm feeling a lot better about this for the simple fact that we should just be able to debuff him to death. I'm guessing he's over here in the far and yeah, but I'm hoping we can just debuff him to death, and that's pretty much the goal. Okay, what do we want to do? Man, these guys have a lot of dodge. A little lower your dodge. It's always hard to hit these guys, they're so tricksy. Need you. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. Hound Terry for the multi-target bleed, maybe? Or maybe we just lower this guy's protection. He might die in a couple turns, though, to be honest. Alright, now they're both fled. Now if the Jester goes and then double bleeds him again. That hook did actually hurt quite a bit considering I have 25% protection. Ooh, no bleed. I'm a little concerned with damage happening to us on this composition, actually. Confidence surges so as the one enemy guy dead. Crumbles. He's dead as well because the bleed. That worked well. Shit, yeah. Alright. Now we need to lower either his damage or something. Or we need to just kill him in turn, but I doubt that's gonna happen. Ow, don't stun please. Never mind, it works perfectly. You know what? Good job. You did it, boy. You stunned me. I'm not mad. I'm, just... I'm a rage and cage. Very angry. <laughs> I forgot that the uh, bleeds that he stacks now are pretty damn significant. He deals good damage too, man. The high level Helm Master just really knocked it up a notch with that buff. We took a little bit of HP damage, it's nothing that we can't uh, fix that. 
Wow, we bled him that time, but the guy who's actually the meant to bleed dream. targets didn't bleed. Perhaps the turning point. Alrighty then. But luckily we didn't even take damage from it, so let's continue. Hopefully nobody checks out those books for some reason, man. Books are all the rage these days. Let's find things to kill. That was, that was the plan. Uh, I don't like this fight. I just don't want to be stressed. I just I ain't got time for none of that stressing business. Hey, if this guy bleeds instead, he resisted two bleeds? Come on. <laughs> get real. Get, get real. What the frick? These guys are so dodgy, man. As the right, well, we falls, killed him, but he already got his turn off, so I guess it doesn't. Blossoms. I guess he's not really too perturbed by it. Ow. I hate stress. It ruins my day. Ooh, good dodge. Okay, a butcher's cut. And we got another dodge. Wow. That worked well. That guy's dead on his turn. Uh, we just gotta start applying DPS to this front guy, I suppose. We could do another Hound Terry, or we could focus on DPS. I'm gonna go ahead and focus. Sadly, it's not gonna kill. And there's no way we can convert it into one, so let's buff up. How much HP is he missing? Two. I can do two. Or not, damn it. He's so dodgy. <laughs> Ow, 10 damage on 25% protection. With a four bleed. Jesus, I'm sorry. I didn't know it was that serious. Alright, so now this guy is dead anyway. He is in the blade. danger zone, but he's dead. No use in wasting an attack on him. We are gonna need some heals though. This guy is taking some DPS. He heal himself for 10 though. It's pretty damn good if you ask me. We'll lower this guy's damage. Mainly because he freaking hurts, man. Wow. 13. With a 3 bleed, he has 5 beast. HP. The Son of a the bitch. Glory. Ball and chain. No stun? Of course he got the stun. That guy stuns every time. It's almost impressive, to be honest with you. Let's just, I was gonna say let's try to get Cheese Hill in, Give but them no quarter. let's just finish him off. We'll eat some of this, and we'll force you to open this in case you get double inflicted here. No dice. Okay, no fight either direction, so... Go with you. 9% chance to disarm. I believe he could have done it too and disarmed. He's like, what, 80? He's, yeah, he's 80. I probably should have done with him for the uh, stress relief. Oh well. Before I forget, we did bring this suit for a reason, so it's not wasted. Getting that light up. Hopefully, there's no fights in one of these directions. Alright, so yes, we can skip a fight. Uh, but we're gonna do a fight no matter what here, so I think we're gonna go over here in case that is a buffing thing. A little bit less stress. It's kind of open when we'd run into one of those, uh. I can't even think of their names. It's almost worth it to go check these two to see if one of them could be the buff. Actually, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> what a twist! Alright, so here's something we can get rid of one of these things with. I might get rid of Curious. Actually, I hate Curious, so I'm pretty sure that's what I'm gonna get rid of. Um, he has a lot of bad stuff. Actually, I want to get rid of Lazy Eye, if at all possible. So let's see if we get lucky. No, Plutomania. That's fine. I think it was definitely worth coming down this direction. Then. The match is struck. A blazing star is I born. I hate this fight. Whose damage do I want to lower? I kind of want to lower his damage, but we're going to be focusing him. Let's lower yours. You're going to be AOing. I hope we kill him early enough to where it doesn't really matter. But it does concern me. So this guy's dead. I like that. This guy's taking a lot of damage. Let's go ahead and multi-target bleed everybody. There we go. So he's already bleeding for seven. This guy in the back's bleeding for three. Blanket fire hurts pretty bad. But he is dead. We should be able to focus one attack on this guy and bring him down. It's just the big guy we gotta worry about now. And we got a full team resist. Wow, that doesn't happen very often. Jesus, that is a lot of damage from the freaking Jester, man. This guy's 11 bleed already. Make that a 15. Holy moly. That's an 18 bleed right there. 
And he's dead. Wow. Our damage is incredible. It's damage over time, really. As victories Kinda. mount, oh, no. so too will resistance. Let's drop this for a, for a full gold stack and we'll continue on our way. Actually, we're not going to continue on the way. We're going to double back and then we're going to camp. Because I almost forgot to do that. Um, there's not too many camping skills we're going to be here for. It's mostly the HP and the spark the relief of stress. It's a goal without hope. Okay, so first thing, we're definitely going to take the timber dam or the 20 damage to size 2. Definitely going to sharpen our spear. We are definitely just going to boost your damage even more. Now, who has lost stress? We got nearly 20, nearly 10. So I can... Wait, do we have something that reduces the nighttime chances of uh, being uh, jumped on? That would be convenient to have. Looks like we don't, so I am just going to do what I was going to do before. Or I can do this and get rid of both of them. I think I'm going to do that. Nice music, bro. Alright, let's hope for no nighttime fight. The oh, light, you're lucky. The promise of safety. Oh, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. I'm not. I'm not shaking in my little space boots, but I'm pretty nervous. Okay. 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 We're fine. Hundred light. Way is lit. Let's go. The path is clear. We All right. Require lower damage. Strength to follow it. Dog knock. That's fine. All right. So he double marked us. First thing, lower his damage. He got debuffed. Take the doggy now. How much damage could we do? We could almost one shot him, but I'm not even gonna risk it yet. Well, wow! What the frick? Incredible damage out the gate there. Alright, are we stacking that bleed or are we stacking that bleed? Yeah, but it's up to 12 already. That's a lot of damage. Holy shit. The double stun a plus a crit. Damn it. And it got both of them. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh, we missed! Come on! Shit. As life ends, Alex might be going here. Terrible vistas of emptiness reveal themselves. Oh, fuck. oh my god, I got the stun again. This is no place for the weak or the foolhardy. I can't hound Terry. Gonna try. If we can reduce his damage down to zero, I think we have a chance. Mm, God damn it, it hurts so bad. Nice resist. I mean, it still hurts, but 20 turns, I think we can kill him in 20 turns. Sadly, we can only attack with one character, so. Oh my god, he's so dodgy. We need to remove that dodge. Son of a bitch. Still has a 13 bleed on him. Mmm, it hurts so bad. I mean, do we dare try to remove the dodge? He still has his damage. And we got the stun. We might have to leave, guys. I don't think there's anything we can do. I think we have to leave. With with him stunned, we can't bring his damage down any further. With him marked, he will be on death's door. Wilbur will one-shot him. This skirmish may God be lost, damn it. but the battle may yet be won. Is it ever gonna happen? Wounds to be tended. Lessons to be learned. Will it 
ever happen. That's the second fight Richard's seen that's we've lost some money. I was lord of this place before the crows and rats made it their domain. I don't know if we're ever gonna beat that fight. Wilbur, man. Wilbur's OP as shit. Damn it, damn it, damn it. More trinkets lost. Well, I guess that's gonna do it for this episode, guys. If you guys liked it, hit that like button or uh, leave a comment in the comment section below letting me know whatever you guys need me to know. I read, I read and respond to every single comment and um, maybe you can give me some tips. I just, I'm getting obliterated. The, the big guy got two lucky dodges in a row on the negative damage. Maybe we should have brought his dodge now first. That's definitely a mistake. We'll know better for next time, but I guess that's it, guys. Uh, subscribe for more daily content. Recommend the channel to your friends. And I hope you guys have the most amazing day in the whole world. See you guys.